the new AI model by OpenAI, O3 Alpha. O3 Alpha seems to be a um, specialized variant of O3, which is like um, really focused in, in programming. It actually outperforms Grok3 and other models. And a few days earlier, we also had Kimi V2, which was done on cloud as Sonnet. Yeah. yeah. And the Sonnet, thing with yeah. generally these models is like, um, they are growing more and more capable and with more and more context. I would really like to see in the LLM arena how this model will perform over the next few days. OpenAI O3 Alpha is second on the uh, arena. Will open source win? Because what is special about these models? Um, these are closed model, most of them. Some of them are open weight and some are open source. And if, you know, the, the foundational model and the, the end product that we have are, you know, getting better and better every single time and open source ones are also included there, then to me, it's like, why would OpenAI be a winner or like why Microsoft and Google are spending so much money when while open source is keeping up. They're getting better, especially the small models. They get more and more capable, but they won't reach to the big players. There's a second category, and that's fine tunes. We can fine tune it to be actually better than um, a uh, co company released model. The big issue we have with LLMs right now is the tooling, or tooling is bad. As an example, the deep research is just a chain of tool codes, or let's say with programming, why do we need to, uh, let's say, why do we need to give all the code of uh, literally everything method if we just have meta deck descriptions as an example, and basically just like um, let the LLM navigate a, a, basically a graph of a function definitions and a description of what the function does. It could way easier um, program applications to have like many more safeguards and easily uh, track down bugs. We need to teach the LLM a fundamentally way safer and way, uh, e basically a safer and more stable way to use uh, tools and generally do programming and things like that. And in that regard, I think open source will win. Basically not, with the, not on the model side, but on the tooling side.